Hey guys, Bing here. Um, today I'm going to show you how to quickly adjust a topography to suit your building. Okay, so let's start. First, I'm going to create a, gen uh, a project and then let's go to 3D view and I'm going to create a topography place point. So first I'll place some point at zero level and I'll also place some point at one meter maybe some point at 3 meter and at 5 meter um, actually I'm going to place some more points or oh, 4 meters out here delete, delete so this is 1, 2, 1 I'll place some more points Okay like this okay so now this is our site and finish it and I'm going to change it to existing okay so now go to at east elevation so now um, we need to decide where the I'll just temporarily hide this or uh, hang on I'll, I'll change this to complete so Okay, so first I'm going to decide where my building sits. So in this side, I'm going to sit it about here. Okay, so we need to, uh, I'll just lock this height and just move this uh, ground floor level up a little bit. Maybe about here. Yep. So now let's go to 3D view and um, uh, let's place the building so wall maybe roughly here and uh, maybe go to the front a little bit yeah like 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 this okay so which means uh, we need to cut we need to cut at the back and fill at the front okay so and I'll also change the height to 3 meter high. Oh, that's actually a big house. I'll make it smaller. Okay, so create. let's create a floor. And also a roof. And okay. And maybe I'll just attach the roof. So now this is a building. Okay, so this is a building and we are going to adjust the side to match the building. So first select this side. So this is a existing side and then go to oh, not select. You don't need to select it before before you do this. Okay, sorry. Uh, go messing and side graded region and then create new topography exactly like the existing one and then click on this one and finish it so now we have two topography here so one is uh, existing and demolished and the other one is created a new so okay so let's change the face filter to uh, previous and new so we'll hide the existing one Okay, so now let's adjust this side to to match the building. Okay, so go first before I before we do that. So let's just decide where where your side needs to be. So for example, on this side, I I want um, a little bit backyard here, which means I we need a cap here and maybe some retaining wall, and at the front we, we probably need some front uh, garden or uh, long or some something flat um, side so what I'm going to do I'll just create a, a floor okay so I'll create a floor roughly uh, depending on your side what the garden is what so front yard maybe like this um, I guess something like this okay so finish it now wireframe wf and click click on select on this topography edit surface so all the points in inside 
don't worry about them don't worry we will delete them but not now so first we're going to place some point okay so place point and change absolute elevation to relative surface and then place on the edge of this floor we created so for example one two three four five uh, this point maybe we will delete it later okay so but don't worry about it now so one roughly just roughly place them okay so now we can delete all the points in the middle and I think I will delete this one as well it won't change much so that's fine delete and then we, we need place another set of points okay so still the same relative to surface and at the back where there's a, a retaining wall so i'm going to place it very close to the previous one and also here and maybe here so and here and here and these front ones i'm going to place it a little bit fur further further to the pre previous ones like this Okay, so after you place, so now select all the in, internal ones. You can do it like this. And then we need to change the level of internal ones to the um, the bottom of the floor. Okay, so let's just go to the east elevation to check the, so 22 minus 150, the floor is 150, which means, oh, sorry, we need to select them again. And do it this way yeah and so turn so which means it's 2050 and now finish it let's go to 3d view or oh, we're already in 3d view just rotate it hr for sd and i'll delete this floor we don't need it anymore so now you can see the site is finished so so that's flat at the front yeah and the back will be straight cut and then you can place a retaining wall there and also um hang on let me check yeah it looks okay so see some funny shade shadow there but uh looks okay yeah so i just do i'll just do it section box so we can see we can see the cut easier so yeah so see okay so that's it um, if you have any question please let me know I'll yeah, I'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye.